Hi, I'm Tim, the cheap 3D printer. With uh, every new version of Cura uh, comes more and more experimental features. And um, I showed the tree supports not long ago in a video that uh, got lots of views. Lots of people love seeing the difference between the tree supports and the regular supports. And uh, that got me looking through more and more of the experimental features in Cura. And one that intrigued me was one called Fuzzy Skin. Fuzzy Skin. So I started looking into it and uh, found out that what it does is it jiggles your print head around to make the outside skin of the uh, model fuzzy. So I decided, hey, let's go ahead and print something and let's uh, show everybody what is uh, Fuzzy Skin is all about. So... Um, let's real quickly go over to Cura. Let's uh, see what uh, where we find fuzzy skin. So here in Cura, if you go over here, you can go all the way down to the bottom. You can find uh, where you got experimental. You can click on any one of these uh, gears um, in any of this and click the gear. Up here in the filter, this is the real easy way to do it. Just hit fuzzy skin, and you can see already I've got everything already clicked um, here so that I can see it and so that I can use it. And so you'll find it in the experimental features. So you can click close there once you've got it. Now over here when we click fuzzy skin, we can click that we want fuzzy skin, and we can go down here and we can change some of these settings. Um, you know, they say the width within which to jitter... Um, it's advised to keep this below the outer wall width, which the outer wall width will be 0.4. Um, fuzzy skin density, um, you know, you can change that around. Fuzzy skin distance. I left all this normal. I left this all as it was um, by default. So that's um, what you get. Now you don't see any change to your model. It does not change anything um, on here. It may change a little bit when you go to the X-ray, or not the X-ray view, but the uh, layer view. I don't know if it actually changes anything on here. It uh, it might as we go down, but really you can't, you know, can't really see uh, much anyway. So that is how you change it in Cura to get fuzzy skin. Now let's see what fuzzy skin actually looks like. So, I printed off these uh, Louie or Luby, Luby the Squirrel, Luby the Squizzle Squirrel or something of that sort uh, model that I found. I printed two samples of it, one with fuzzy skin, one without fuzzy skin. Um, so let's just look at the, uh, the normal one first. Um, you can see here the normal one, I mean, it's a normal print. This is a pretty decent print. It did a good, pretty decent job on my Anet A8. Um, there's definitely, I could have cooled it a little bit better. There's a little bit of drooping here, but this is supposed to print without supports. Um, and it did a pretty darn good uh, job. Uh, there might be a little, few little blobs here and there, but it did a decent job of printing uh, Luby the squizzle squirrel or something of that sort um, this is 50 percent scale so he definitely is a lot bigger in normal scale but i didn't want to wait uh you know like six hours for it to print so printed it at 50 percent scale it printed this in a little over an hour i printed one with the fuzzy skin now, i'm not sure if you're going to be able to see that let me see if i can i think the it tries to focus so hard, but this thing has fuzzy skin that it's hard for it to find a focal point. Um, so maybe you can see that the fuzziness there. You can definitely see it a lot better right there. Um, fuzziness that it puts in the model as it jitters around. Um, I realized after I printed this that I didn't have the fan hooked up correctly, so it did do a little bad job underneath the... Uh, uh, the overhang there, but um, but you can see just the fuzziness that is on there. That's fuzzy skin. Um, I'll be real honest with you. 
I don't see the point. Um, I think if you print it, if you could print, you know, part of your print with it on there, you know, if I could have printed just the tail with fuzzy skin, that might have been kind of cool. Um, or printed the entire model but left the eyes out, maybe the, the acorn out, so it actually looked like an acorn instead of just this fuzzy glob that he's holding. Um, maybe that would have been nice. But to print an entire model with this fuzzy skin, I really don't uh, see the point. I will say this much. My hats are off to the people at uh, Ultimaker and uh, Cura. Um, for all the work that they're doing on Cura, they continually just are releasing new and new um, experimental things, and those experimental things end up into our regular features. So I want to encourage you to get into those experimental features. Play around with them a little bit. Play around with fuzzy skin. If you print something that looks really cool with fuzzy skin, please share it with us. Share it in the comments below. Share it on Reddit. Share it on uh, the 3D printing page on uh, Facebook. Uh, share it around. Let us see the cool prints that come out with uh, the fuzzy skin. But as of right now, I don't really see a point uh, in using it for a model. Maybe if it, you had uh, a multi-piece model that you could do it with, that might be something. But as of this point, I don't really see the point. But there you go. Fuzzy skin. Fuzzy skin model. Regular model. I still like the regular model better. And uh, that's what I'll be printing. But it was worth it to see the difference between the fuzzy skin and the regular skin. Hope you enjoy this. If you like what I'm doing, click subscribe below. Uh, click that uh, bell icon to, to know when I do more, model, more uh, videos. Um, click the like button if you like this video. If you don't like this video, let me know why. Um, but I wanted you to see what fuzzy skin looked like. And uh, also there'll be a GearBest link down below. Um, you can click that link, do your shopping on GearBest. Any proceeds that come through that will go right back into the channel to help make the channel better. Other than that, have a great day. Keep printing and keep printing cheap.